you can create a list full of amazing resources, but it's also important that students are able to easily find the information they need to understand and complete their assignments. You can help students by editing the organization of your list and adding information to the individual items on the list. Looking at your list, you might decide that an item belongs in a different place or that you want to add a new section or rename a section. It's easy to reorganize your list at any time. To move an item in the list, hover over the item and click and hold the blue panel. You can drag the item to anywhere in the list, including to a new section. To add a new section, Click on New Section, add a title and descriptive information if you would like, and then Create. If you simply want to edit the title of an existing section, open the drop-down box and click Edit Section. Here you can edit the title and descriptive information and save. You can also edit the information for any individual item in your list. To edit an item, open it by clicking on the title. Once you've opened the item, you can edit any of the publication information here. You can also add tags to an item that indicate to a student whether an item is recommended, essential, optional, or lecture reading. You can add a single tag or multiple tags. Tags are useful because students can filter their list by those tags, making it easy for them to identify materials that are required. You can also add tags from the brief display, which we'll see in a moment. To add a due date, click on the calendar icon in the due date section and simply select the date you would like students to have the assignment completed by. You'll see the date appear here. You can add a public note, which will appear on the item to students. This is useful for communicating additional information, such as specific information you want them to pay attention to, pages that they should read, or even just helpful tips for completing the work. You can also add a private note, which would appear only to you. This might be a reminder of points you want to make when discussing this item with your students, or even observations about what well or not well when discussing this, so that you're prepared when you teach a class in a future semester. Once you've finished editing the information for the item, simply close out. We can now look at this item in the brief display. We see the due date that was added, the tag that was added here, as well as that note we left for our students. Again, you can edit the tags from the brief display by clicking on the pencil icon here and then saving.